truth is almost upon us here. They are about to drop the puck. Don't you just love playoff hockey? Listen to this place. Let's get after it. And a stick in the lane ends that threat. Eichel's into the offensive zone now on the attack. Spurgeon's tripped up, and the official's hand is in the air, signaling penalty. And let's see what the call is. Oh, that's a tough way to start a game. I get it. The adrenaline's flowing, and sometimes you're just a little too over-aggressive. Minnesota's main advantage unit will take to the ice for the first time tonight. First power play of the game, and an opportunity to go up by one. And analytics will tell you, when you score first, chances are you win the game. Hammers a shot! away. Looking to clear the defensive zone. Blocked at the line and kept in. Now you can... Oh, off the outside of the frame. And Attendee's going to hang on and get a whistle here and a reset. Much needed one at that. Oh, yeah. I mean, they have just been taking control of in their own zone, James, and they needed this reset. They needed the goaltender to pounce on that puck. They can all collect themselves and get a line change. Nice play, shorthanded as they get control of the puck. And that's a solid clearing attempt on the play. Minnesota's got to hold of it against the wall. From the defensive zone, they move the puck around. Now a quick pass to Eric Sinek. Centering pass! And that's intercepted. Here's a shot. Glove save. at the face-off dot, ready to win this, drawing the man advantage. The Golden Knights win the draw here in their own end. Vegas plays it up ahead. Minnesota's got the puck in the defensive end. Moves it quickly over to Kaprizov. Can't stay on his feet after that hit. From the slot! in terms of their passing along the outside. And then they attack the net with a shot. You have to have net front presence and create a screen. That's exactly what they have. And they capitalize as a result. The Wild have looked sharp so far tonight. Look at this. They've already got the lead. They're doing so many great things. Right off of the face-off in the opening frame, in the first five minutes, they get the lead. And it's because of their communication, their intensity, all of those intangibles that coaches love to hear, they're setting it tonight. The Golden Knights get a hold of the puck along the boards. Knocked away with the stick by Middleton. Minnesota's moving it along the wing. Here's a shot. Oh, to Madison with the palace save. The Golden Knights in transition at center. Vegas plays it against the boards. And he takes a shot. Gets a pat on it. What a stop by Fleury. And he takes the feed. Here he is in front. Too much congestion blocks the shot. And he's knocked off the puck there. Minnesota's gained possession along the boards. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. Moves it to Johansson. Scores! And they straight play that once again. What do they do? They're down on their heels. They're deflated. They gotta find a way to continue with the pressure. Be very practice and try and get another one. But there's not much time here before the goaltender's eyes are taken away, James, and he drops into that butterfly position. All you want to do when you can't see the puck is make yourself as big as possible. But this one has seeing eyes from traffic and finds the back of the net. Still plenty of time left in this frame. Minnesota's been the better team here over the last few minutes, increasing their lead to two. Lands from the puck here at center. Polisar's got it along the wing. Flurry's going to slow it down here and hang on for the whistle. Well, a good decision right there to dictate the tempo of the game, especially when he hasn't been busy. He's engaging right now. Minnesota's firing on all cylinders here early in this one, and they lead. Sends a pass over. Takes the pass. Just slide. Here's a 
short pass to Carrier. Rips it. Taken down, the officials caught it. And the play is whistled dead. Here's the call. Johansson's called for tripping. He's off to the box. Our first look tonight at their power play unit. Well, first power play of the game, James. You want to start with possession and look to get shots to the net. It is the tone setter. Comes up with a stop. Oh, the... Oh, it's so bad. Oh, my goodness, what a stop. Oh, that's unbelievable, James. I have no idea how he got to that puck. It's some gymnastics at its finest. Such an impressive save. Love looking at this one again, James. You know that this goaltender is dialed in so focused when they're doing everything to get to the puck and keep their opponent at bay. Gautreaux gliding in for the face-off as this penalty kill will continue. Minnesota's won the defensive zone draw. An attempt to clear the puck from deep inside his own end. Quick feed to Theodore. I don't think anybody was hanging onto the puck after that hit. Quick pass to Theodore. Moves the puck into the attacking area. They'll want to clear the zone here while they're trying to kill off this penalty. And the puck leaves the offensive end. They'll be forced to do it over from center. To his teammate! Oh, how did he get a glove on that? What a stop by Fleury! Rossi's ready for the draws. They will continue to try to kill off this penalty. They take possession as he locks them. Scores! They convert on the power play and get it done. And it's so important when you're on the power play to have precise execution of your passes and you're able to move the covers. That's exactly what they did and they're able to convert. I love the patience of this power play. It's all about puck movement. And when you're going to let a shot go, you want to make sure that there's traffic net front. And that's exactly what happens. The goaltender scream and they find the back of the net. Lots of time left in this period. The Golden Knights make their way back into the face-off circle, still in search of another goal. Rossi's won the draw inside the neutral zone. They'll go to work offensively here. On the attack along the boards. And he slides it quickly to Bogosian. Hill's gonna hang on for a whistle. Barbashev's been feeling it, James. You know who else is feeling it? His teammates. They have been the beneficiaries of a great leader on the ice who's just been distributing the puck and generating a ton of offense. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Good read with the stick to break that up. Taken along the wall by Merrill. Bokosian's moving the puck through his own zone. and the will to stop that puck. The goaltender, they have to have talent. They have to have mobility. They have to be able to track the puck, but they have to have a willingness to find it and fight for any second shot, and that's exactly what happens here. Out battling, out willing, and you make the save. Michael's so strong on the puck. His balance makes it hard to knock him off, especially when he's using his unstoppable force zone ability. The Golden Knights come up with the defensive zone draw. Vegas looks to break out on their own end. Shot! And the goaltender comes up with a piece of it to keep it out of the net. We got a whistle penalty coming up. Well, the coach isn't going to be happy with this penalty. You have a one goal lead, and now you find yourself back on your heels, and the penalty kill has to come out and do a job. I really like them working off the 1-3-1 sequence that they were successful on earlier, James. It really opens up the ice. So you're using and stretching the entire zone. And listen, there's a lot of ice for the defense to cover. So you can look to the flank, you can look to the bumper, but a lot of options off of it. Great save, played it perfect. The Golden Knights gain possession. Works it across to Watt. the 
boards. Spurgeon's taking it from his own end. He grabs the puck here at the point. There's a great just save by Fleury. Big face-off coming up here in the offensive zone. Well, after that last shift with sustained pressure, you know that the goaltender is fatigued. you got to find ways to get pucks to the net. Stevenson's won the face-off deep inside the offensive zone. And he comes up big with the stick save, getting all of it with the goal. Yes! They score! And putting it home on the power play, and we have even things up here tonight. Right from the beginning of that power play, James, there just was a confidence about them. The way they own the puck, the precision in the movements, the motion in the offensive zone, and they cash in to tie this game. Nearing the midway mark of the period. We are all tied up in this one. Lettieri's won the draw at center. Puck grab by Duhane. Now over to Lettieri. Grabs the puck. Puts it on the Denies him! Lettieri's got control of the puck in the corner. Vegas with possession in their own zone. Great poke check on the reach. Minnesota's got a hold of the puck now. Dumps it into the O-zone. Moves it quickly over to Amadio. They go on the attack through center. Good hit to pump him off the puck. Poked away at center by Lettieri. Dumps the puck in. The Golden Knights gain control of the puck. Picked up along the wall by Eichel. The Golden Knights slide it through center. Dumps it in. The Wild have gained possession off the wall. And it's a quick pass to Zuccarello. And somehow he hangs on. Long reach breaks up the momentum. Feeds it over to Kaprizov. Moves it to Zuccarello. Big time stop. Hills all over that save. I mean, he's dialed in and he recognizes where he has to be at the right time. Shot blocked in front. And now he moves it quickly to Haig. Great pressure on the offensive end by Stone. Along the boards, they battle for the puck. Brodeen's got it in the defensive end. Puck picked up by Kaprizov. Through the neutral zone, up along the wing. Moves it to the middle. What shot. Vegas looks to get things going now with the puck. And now he tries to get it across to Wah. Quick shot! Oh, tremendous reflexes with the glove by Fleury. Well past the midway mark of this period. It's all tied up. The Golden Knights will start off on the attack after winning the draw. Made that stop. The Golden Knights gain possession along the wall. Oh, and it makes a save. Just got enough to keep it out. And he moves it up to Hartman. Here they come. Down the left side on the attack. Steps across the line and on the attack down the right side. Rossi's lugging the puck. Grabs control of it at the point. Referee signals penalty coming up here with a delayed call. There's the whistle, and here's the call. McNabb's going off the cross check. They had success earlier on the power play in this formation, James. Really like that high umbrella where you're using the top of the offensive zone to work some magic, weave some as you move the coverage around. And once you get them running, that's where you can open up your lanes and attack the net. Here's a chance to clear the defensive zone. And they get the puck out of the zone, and that's a break for the squad. Oh, uh, yeah, this PK unit, they're out there for a reason, James. You have to be able to clear the puck, and it's easier said than done, but they make no mistake this time. And they get some breathing room as the puck leaves the defensive end. Here's a short pass to Goudreau. Sends a pass in front. Off the stick, and they can't complete the play. Hills 
got the puck and he's going to hang on. Power play set to roll on as the centers get ready for the faceoff. Minnesota's won it, now they'll go on the attack. Picked off, and the puck leaves the zone. Picked up along the boards by Boudreau. Quick feed to Eriksson Ek. Pass across to Kaprizov. Oh, he couldn't put it past. What a stop by Fleury. Barbashev's recognizing they're still shorthanded here as they get ready for the faceoff. The Golden Knights take possession here inside the offensive zone. And that's broken up. The Wild have the puck against the boards. Minnesota's got it in their own zone. Centering in front. Let's tip in. I don't think this is going to count, James. This looks like it's a high stick, and the official had a good look at it, but they're going to gather themselves and look at it a second time to see if it's above the crossbar. I absolutely love this goal, James, because it's the attention to detail, eyes on the prize, just showing how dialed in you are to be able to have that hand eye coordination and put that puck in the net. up to the puck. Erickson X won the draw. Oh, a little cat burglar-like play with the stick. Nicely done. Minnesota's looking to break out of their own end. And he takes the pass. Quick pass to Kaprizov. Great pressure with the stick. 
Slides it on over to Howden. The Golden Knights move to the offensive zone. Minnesota's got the puck. Handles the pass. Broken up by Theodore. Here he is, wristed on net. Long jam and scores! shot just aim for the inside of the post and know that it's gonna go in that's not typically the case but tonight it is the wild have taken advantage of some opportunities here in the first and now lead it by one well yeah i do feel like they've had the edge in the play here james and they're rewarded with the go-ahead goal but they're gonna have to find a way to continue to push continue to press because they're in a game Regains possession at center. Handles the puck. Sends the pass over. And they cough it up at center. Slides the puck ahead to Rossi. Pushes it across to White Cloud. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Oh, what a save in front. Well, he makes an incredible save on a point blank shot here, James. I love the way he's aggressive, he's competitive, and he wins the battle. Golden Knights continue to trail despite multiple scoring opportunities here in the late stages of this first period. Back underway as he wins the try inside the offensive zone. Scores! Off the post and in! Well, that's a real sneaky one that fooled the goaltender, James. I had not much room available, but that one, perfectly executed. On a deflected shot, everyone always talks about the stick positioning. How about the timing to get to the slot area as well? And the ability to just tap it down and redirect it. Getting into the later stages of this period, we got a tie game. Gautreaux's won it. And he's pulled over to the ice and loses the puck. And he loses control here. Feeds it across the ice to Stevenson. The Golden Knights work it through center. Comes up with a steal. Minnesota's looking to break out. Feeds it on over to Goudreau. Great use of the twig as he pokes that one away. Great heads up play with the stick by Brodeen. Minnesota's got a hold of the puck. Now a quick pass to Johansson. With some open space at center. From the left side, takes it at center. Big stop just as time expires in the period. That's it for period number one. Second period action coming up in moments here on EA Sports. are back on the ice. Both squads gliding into position for the start of period number two. Well, despite all that firepower and goals scored in the first, we're still tied here as we get underway in the second. Well, Charles, how do you sum this one up through the first 20 minutes? Minnesota's got to find their legs, James. I mean, right from puck drop, they just haven't had it. No sense of urgency, and as a result, they haven't been on the attack. The minority of shots, and really, it's their goaltender that's kept them in this one. It's a tie game. Drives to the sweet spot, they score! And the deadlock is broken as they take the lead! Well, that's a huge shift. We can see everyone standing up on the bench. They know how much it means, but it's the next shift that matters most now, James. You want to kind of push and put pressure on your opponent when they're down. James, these are the kind of pesky goals that create a ton of energy for your team. The rebound pops out after the shot. You have to have a hard stick, heavy on it, with it on the ice, battling for feet for it. He does it, he buries it. The Wild have a little breathing room now, up by one in the second. Yeah, and it's real important time right now, James. They've got the go-ahead goal. Now it's about having the killer instincts. Play in attack mode, stay aggressive. There's a lot of runway left, but if you can get another, you can really sink your opponent. Takes it to the front. The Wild have the puck in their own zone. Brodeen's been brought down, and we're going to get a penalty here. 
There's the whistle. Let's get the official decision. The trailing by one and you take the penalty. Not the way to get back in the game. Shorthanded here. Offense is on face off, and he wins the draw. Oh, how did he keep it out? What a blocker stop by Hill. And that's deflected off someone in front from the top of the offensive zone here. And he slides it quickly to Goudreau. Takes the puck. Great defensive effort with the stick. It's in the back of the net. He scores! The goalie coaches work all the time with one screen or one player in front, James, and he's got to do a good job of finding this puck. I mean, it just beats him clean. The Golden Knights have jumped right back into this one here in the second with that goal. And you can certainly feel the momentum changing tides right there, James, especially after that goal. They've cut the deficit within one. Rossi's gained possession inside the neutral zone. Takes the pass to the offensive zone. And that goes off course off a of body. Gains the zone through center. Takes a shot, fires it on net, scores! I got two words for you, new game. Yeah, it certainly is, James, and who's going to come out on top by the beginning of this face-off? You want to be able to get that puck in the offensive zone and find a way to continue to attack. The Golden 
tonight some even things up here in period number two we got ourselves a new game yeah you love these games that go back and forth and they've worked hard to get to this point and now they got the equalizer giddy up and they win that neutral zone draw Polisar's carrying it ahead Wah is able to corral that pass he's got the puck on his stick you know he's dangerous he's got two in the game and he's looking for another and now he moves it quickly to Polino. And he slides it quickly to Johansson. And he feeds it down to Goudreau. Inside his own end, moves the puck. Minnesota's got it along the wall. Sends the feed in front, and that's stopped. There he is from the slot. Big save by the goaltender once again. The shot's come from the middle of the ice, and it has some heat on it, but he's ready and waiting for it. He's to position, and he makes the save. Play is called for offside. Both teams are set. We'll drop the puck here. And with the two centers tangled up, the winger skates away with it. Sends the feet in front, and he shuts down a great scoring chance there. Oh, wow, stops him again. Well, you know that he's a fierce competitor, and he battled to make consecutive saves there, James. Stars, the go-ahead goal. Them in front. Well, now they're in front, James, so they'll have some energy. You know that their first few strides will be more urgent, but they'll have to be accountable on the other side of the puck as well. are finding that little extra pep in their step here in the second period and have taken a one goal lead as a result. Well, they break the deadlock and that's huge. Now you're playing in front but I think this face-off and the shift that ensues is critical, James. Now you got your opponent right where you want him. You're back on their heels. Take advantage and try and get another one. Taken by Caprizo. Oh, just got a piece of that one with that glove to keep it out. I really like this save, James, because he challenges the shooter who's all alone in the slot area. He turns aside a real dangerous opportunity. The Golden Knights are playing from the corner. And there's a great save by Flurry. And the puck stopper hangs on to get a breather here for the team. Nice job tying up his opponent. Here they come through center and into the offensive end. Vegas gets the puck near the boards. Here's a great use of the stick right there to poke it away. Rossi's looking to make something happen here in the corner. Vegas moves ahead with the puck. Aims the zone along the right wall. Takes a bump but hangs on to the puck. Rossi's feeling that, and someone's going to the box. Let's see what the officials say. He needs to find a way to manage his emotions here because they're creeping into his game. That's a second penalty he's taken this period. Back to the face-off circle. They'll send the man advantage unit out again. Well, a timely power play at this juncture of the game, James, to even it up. This is huge for this power play. Your big stars, they need to shine. Oh, and he just puts it wide of the net. Off his stick. And that caroms off a body in the lane. And that's kicked away by Johansson. Denied that one. Tremendous pressure here in the offensive end. Puck cleared from the defensive end. Here he is, all alone. Oh, the eyes on the play. Great play by the tender to anticipate and get across to make that save. Oh, how did he get a piece of that to make the save? Trying to shake loose. All alone. Great save. There's the whistle as the puck stopper elects to hang on. Can they capitalize on this power play? Here comes the face off. Well, that's one way to win the draw as he skates away with the puck after the two centers were tied up. Reaches out and uses the stick. Can't hang on to the puck after taking it off. Gets it out of his own end. 
Erickson X got it across the line. There's a shot stopped by the goaltender. This is a fantastic save, James. He's all over it. What I mean by that is he knows exactly where it is and where it's moving, a reason why he can get square to it and make the save. Cotter's side still shorthanded here as they slide in for the faceoff. Musa quickly over to Boldy. Turns him away. On the backhand. Turns another aside. I'm not sure if anyone's helping him out there, but he's dialed in and doing it all himself, making consecutive saves. Hope everyone's enjoying the game here tonight. Another big face-off here on this power play. The Golden Knights get a hold of the puck in their own end. Pass to Romberg. With the puck inside the defensive zone. There's the whistle as the puck goes out of play. The officials are in position, and both teams are getting ready as they get set for another face-off here. Vegas wins the draw. Under Siege trying to get it out of their zone. Gets it out of his own end. Minnesota's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Moves it to Zuccarello. Oh, a clutch save! Marshall is almost back on the ice. Vegas gains possession shorthanded. Puck clears the zone. And he takes the dish. Vegas keeps that one goal lead after killing off the penalty. Specialty teams are critical, especially when you're down by a goal and you have an opportunity to get the equalizer, and they just weren't able to generate. When we have a look at it, James, it looks like it's redirected, and that's just beautiful timing and get hands away from the body, be able to get it to go the opposite direction of the goaltender. And they take control of the puck here in the neutral zone. The Golden Knights get a hold of the puck in their own end. Passes over to Theodore. They've got numbers here. Great glove save by Flurry. And they'll cover it up, forcing a stoppage in play. The Golden Knights win that offensive zone faceoff. Lays out with a block. Now can he get up? Oh! Vegas looks to move the puck from their own end. Gains the zone from the right. Great read with the stick. Here's a short pass to Carrier. And that's stopped by Fleury. A chance in front! Great defensive play to pick off the pass. Dishes it to Goudreau. Oh, had a chance to make a nice move and the puck disagreed with him. It almost looked as if he was going to get by the defender, but that extra move took his face away, and it goes the other way. In front, and a stoppage on the play as the goaltender covers things up. Face-off looming as both centers get into position. The Golden Knights win the face-off. Off a stick. Good use of the body to knock them off the puck. To that. Minnesota's got it in their own zone. Tucked away by Petrangelo. Puck scooped up by Stone. Scores! The go-ahead goal puts them in front. Well, and this has been trending to happen, James. They've been closing on the puck quickly since an upward trajectory as this game's progressed and they find the back of the net. Man, James, he's the benefactor of a great passing play. I mean, incredible vision to be able to land that puck right on his stick. But then he's got to do something with it, right? He's got to read where the goaltender is, and he's got to hit the back of the net. The Golden Knights, through their hard work and tenacity, have taken a one-goal lead here in the second. It's certainly better to play with the lead, James, but you know that there's a lot of one way left, and your opponent is going to come pushing and pressing. This game has been tight all the way around, and I expect that it will continue to be. Moves the puck inside the offensive 
offensive zone. The Golden Knights look to start the transition game. Slides the puck across to Theodore. And that one's stolen at center ice. Here's a chance. Scores! It's in the back of the net. And it comes from an unlikely source because that's his first career playoff goal. He's been relentless, James, in his playoffs. And you know what? He's found a way to find the back of the net. That's going to be a huge confidence boost for himself and his teammates. Well, I really like the effort on this goal, James. He shows a knack for the net and being real hard and heavy on his stick as he's able to put that rebound in the net. Goaltender's got to clean that up, though. That one got kicked right back out. And off the face-off, they take possession. The Golden Knights play it along the way. And the puck skips off the goal. Now a quick pass to Theodore. Picks off the pass. Great hand-eye coordination as he gets the puck back. Scooped up along the wall by Theodore. Steps inside. For point blank. What a block of stop at point range by Fleury. And he slides it quickly to Martinez. Unbeatable. That's a fantastic sequence of saves there. James, he was so dialed in, he tracked it perfectly. Minnesota's got the puck in the defensive end. Along the side, here they come through the neutral zone. What a hit on the play! Oh, my! Well, you clearly knew what he was doing here. He got all of them, tags them, knowing full well that he's going to disengage that puck. <laughs> Love it. away from the face-off. Let's get back to the action. They take possession as he locks him up off the face-off. The Golden Knights gain control of the puck against the wall. Gets the full use of his stick on the poke check. Steps into the offensive end. Vegas takes possession along the wall. Quick feed to Wah. Poked away at center by Merrill. Grabbed along the board by Eric Zanek. Moves along the boards with some purpose. Centering pass in front. Oh, and he comes up with a stop. Good reach to the stick to knock the puck away. Minnesota's on the attack. Oh, stick save and a few. Oh, these are the saves when you know that your goaltender is dialed in, James. The ability to get to the top of the crease and be square to the shooter, that's a great save. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Vegas has it in the defensive end. Here they come on the attack. Takes a shot. Scores! There it is, the go-ahead goal. And how good does that feel? You can see the selling. The energy is certainly there, and now it's about dictating the pace going forward. Next shift, critically important. I like that the shooter had the mentality, just shoot it right away on the inside of the post, just recognizing that there was enough of an opening, and I think that the goaltender thought it was covered. through and have taken a one goal lead here late in period number two. Well, timing is everything, and this has been a scrappy game, James. You have to fight for every inch of ice that you get, so you know heading into this third period, they're going to have to come out on fire and willing to go to battle in the corners. The Wild have the puck in the defensive zone. Quick pass to Boldy. Amadio's taking the puck now here inside his own territory. Moves into the slot. And it goes out of sticking off to the side. Vegas putting in a pretty complete effort to this point as they lead it here late in the second. And they win the draw on their own end. Slides the puck to Johansson. 
A chance in front! And a huge stop by the goaltender at point blank range. Well, that shot came quick and it was right out front. He had to be sharp. He had to be right on it and show his brilliant reflexes. Sends it in deep. Along the boards, they battle for the puck back and forth. Minnesota's got it from behind the net. Oh, let it perfectly. What a save. Solid hit on the play, and that knocks the puck off his stick. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. We've played now 40 minutes in this one, and still a critical 20 minutes still needs to be played. Go stretch your legs, grab that final snack, because the third period is just around the corner. Period number three just moments away as the official signals both teams into position. No shortage of offensive highlights in this one. Let's see if that carries over here as we are underway in the third. Two-thirds of the way to the finish line, and this one for regulation time. Cheryl, how do you view it? Vegas is ahead in this game, but, man, there has been zero defensive structure. It has been all about offense on both sides of the puck here, James. Both teams really flying through the neutral zone, looking for offense anytime they can get it. And they win the draw in the offensive zone, and they go to work. And that slides right out to center ice. Puck grabbed by Brodeen. And that pass attempt is deflected. Taken along the wall by Kaprizov. Minnesota's got the puck against the boards. Quick feed down low. Handles it along the blue line. Denies the slapper. Center and feed. And that's blocked in front. Moves it quickly over to Marcheseau. The Golden Knights carry it along the wall. And he makes the save. Puck is frozen, and we'll get a face-off. Some last-second communication with the D as centers get ready to drop the puck. And they take possession after the defensive zone face-off. And he takes the feed. Moves it to Hartman. And it's a quick pass to Middleton. Picks off the pass in the defensive zone. Great reach by Boldy. Minnesota's got control of it now from their own end. They try to maintain possession inside the defensive zone. Nice dish from the left wing. Handles the puck at the point. And save by Hill. Hartman's been a workhorse tonight, James, and there's just another example of it, and the entire bench knows that they're invigorated by it. I mean, he's on his way down, he's stumbling, and he manages to find the puck and get a shot on net. That's tenacity at its best. Oh, excellent use of the stick as he knocks that one away. Gives him a whack, and the officials are going to call this one. It's a cross! Time for the officials to hand out the judgment. Not a great penalty to take. I mean, you're down a goal. You're trying to fight to get back in this game, and now you find yourself shorthanded. Power play unit going back to work. Power play scored earlier tonight, and that gives you so much confidence heading into this one. You know how you executed the first time. They'll look, be looking for those same openings. Oh, that goes just wide of the net. I think he had more time than he thought here, James, with the pressure coming in on him. He just releases the puck quick, and he misses wide. Oh, he had a beat, but it goes off the inside post. Vegas continues to put the pressure on, and I love that they're a wave in the offensive zone, shift after shift, looking for a time to bite and execute. But, man, could they get a little more luck and continually going off the post? Eichel's ready for the draw on this man advantage. The Golden Knights will start off on the attack after winning the draw. Misses a golden opportunity there. Up along the wing. Oh, what a hit against the puck. Here we go, Cheryl. They're going to go. This is the challenge to that big hit. I thought it was clean, but nonetheless, the gloves are being dropped.
Well, a spirit and strap comes to an end with the takedown. I think he might be relieved as they head to the ice as he was taking the thrashing. <laughs> I think you're right. There's a lot of people in the game who don't like fighting, and you can see the reasons why, but look around in this building. Everyone's standing on their feet and the energy that it's created. Petrangelo's able to defend one-on-one -on -one situations so well because he keeps his cool, reads the play, and stays with his opponent, guys. That's his shutdown zone ability, and it's how he can contain the opposition. Minnesota's going to be able to kill a few seconds off now with the puck. Moves around along the half wall. The Golden Knights gain possession. Eichel is taken down to the ice. We got a penalty coming up. Here comes the call from the official. Such a tough penalty to take when the game's within reach. They're looking for the equalizer, and now they find themselves shorthanded. The Golden Knights with a five on three, and they've got loads of time to work with here. With a long five on three, yes, you have more time, and you know that you've worked on this in practice. The coach wants you to be patient with the puck, but they want you to find an opportunity to drive and attack. You have to move it, or you have to fire it. Offside the call, we'll get a reset. Stevenson's looking to win this draw on this man advantage here. Oh, and he takes possession of the puck from off the wing with the centers all locked up there off the draw. Goaltender hangs on for the whistle. Gautreaux's gliding in for the face-off as this penalty kill will continue. And off the draw, they win possession. The Golden Knights have it in the offensive end. Here's a chance to move the puck outside the zone. And the puck is cleared. Well, you can see the entire PK unit. Their heads are on a swivel, straight line skating, and they're able to get that puck. And because they're looking... Well, well, that's going to be a call, James. That's definitely a penalty. There's the whistle. Let's see what the referee saw. Well, we know the time on ice numbers are all going to the penalty killers here, James, because it has been an onset, a parade to the penalty box. they got to find a way to play even strength. As we're about to drop the puck, the power play unit back out onto the ice for another opportunity. Well, a frustrating situation, no doubt, going to the four on three, but a huge opportunity still approaches them. They have to find a way to capitalize and execute on this one. Here's a pass to the middle. Can't connect on the play. Takes a shot. Turned aside with the glove by Flurry. And we get a whistle as the goaltender decides to hang on to this one. Ross is recognizing they're still shorthanded here as they get ready for the faceoff. Eichel's won the draw and they're on the attack. From the slot, wrist shot. Oh, and he didn't get all of it, but just enough to keep it out of the net. Still some precious time left on this power play as they get set to drop the puck. Rossi's won the draw here in their own zone. Oh, we got a tripping penalty coming up here. The officials were all over that. Three penalties in one period. You got to stay disciplined. And what it does is it disrupts the flow of your bench. Only your PKers are getting out of there. Lots of room on the ice here for a little three on three. Well, it's all about possession, James, and you can see here the ability to be able to read the numbers, but man, you got to know it. Oh, well, there's going to be a call on that one, James. Play whistle, dead penalty coming up. Important task for the PKers ahead of them, up by one, and a real opportunity to protect it. killing unit here down to three men well they create a power play opportunity with hard work and now it's an opportunity to get back in this game james finding a way to move the puck quickly and create seams to get shots on net goaltender covers it up we get a whistle to slow things down erickson x ready to take the draw here on this power play 
Minnesota's won the draw inside the offensive zone. Now let's see what they can do with it. Goaltender covers up. We got a stoppage in play. Blast ready for the draw as they continue to be shorthanded here. Offense is on face off and he wins the draw. Possession under man. And the puck is cleared to a safer spot. The Wild have possession now. And he slides it quickly to Eric Sinek. Shot! Shuts it down with the paddle. What a stop! Takes the feed. Tremendous stop by him. As a defender, you love when your goaltender has this kind of rebound control. It makes your life so much easier. Good clearing attempt to breathe. Quick pass over to Eric Sinek. From the left, breakaway! Oh, beautiful save on the play! And you gotta love these one-on-one -on -one battles. In particular, the goaltender is so aggressive, tracks the puck and makes the save. Minnesota's gained possession along the boards. The Golden Knights take possession here in the open ice. Minnesota's looking to break out of their own end. Across the line and on the attack. Oh, what a stop on the play. Gets all of it with the paddle. The goaltender's at the last line of defense for a reason. This time, he bails his team out. My word, they really got them hemmed in here in their own zone. Looking to clear from their own end. And they can't get it out. Can. They look like they're playing free, so they're moving their feet. They're being creative in their attacking. They're looking to win this game, not just keep it at evens. Big hit, and that frees up possession. Just a little too much contact and couldn't hang on to the puck. The Golden Knights get a hold of the puck under man. Puck hops out of the offensive zone. They'll be forced to do it over from center. Spurgeon's moving the puck through his own zone. And now he moves it quickly to Kaprizov. Here's a shot, and that one's denied. Takes the feed. Oh, it stops him again. What a great job of tracking the puck. Not one, but two consecutive saves. Hartman's ready for the draw as we get set to resume this power play. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. And we got to stop and just the puck sails over the glass. Cotter's ready for the draws. They will continue to try to kill off this penalty. The Golden Knights win the draw. Nice job to escape the zone. Deflected away. Nice defensive use of the stick there. And he shuts down a great scoring chance there. There's a chance in front. Off the stick and they can't complete the play. Oh, a true warrior to block that. Oh, he got a piece of it to keep it out. They are really dialed in here tonight. And pokes the puck loose inside the offensive end. And they'll get it out of the defensive end. One last gas to make something happen on this power play. Petrangelo's up and ready to get back on the ice. Oh, what a stick save! A player should... Oh! What a save! Well, if that doesn't swing momentum in your favor, I don't know what will, James. That's a last-ditch effort to make a play. What a beautiful save. Minnesota's got the puck in their own end. With possession along the wall. Here's a short pass to Brodeen. Goudreau's been whacked on the play. The official's arm is up in the air. And the officials have passed the sentence here. They gotta put a pin in the penalty balloon here, James. The frustrating calls, no 
question about it. They've got to figure out a way to control their emotion and get back in this game. Minnesota's power play unit puts their hard hats on as they go back to work. Power play has just been average tonight, James, but hey, it hasn't been in the basement, right? Here inside the defensive zone, they get the puck. The Wild have it on the attack. And that's intercepted by White Cloud. Hill's last save is one that's going to be remembered for a while, James. It's going to be on the highlight reel. It's on one of mine now. I mean, he stole one there. It was all but in, and that desperation and compete level, it makes the save. How did he stop that one? This is a really nice save, James. I mean, the shooter's in the middle of the ice. is in the slot area, and he's got to get to the top of the crease, square to the puck to be able to make that save. Great job. Barbashev's side still shorthanded here as they slide in for the faceoff. Trying to come up with a huge defensive play to get this puck out of his own end. And loses possession after a solid hit. Gets a glove on it to keep it out. Pinned up along the boards. Minnesota's got the puck along the wall. And he's got won the face off and now let's see what they can do turn that one aside Spurgeon's return to the lineup certainly gives his team some added boost in offense as he gets a dangerous shot right off the hop referee's hand shoots high in the air looks like we got a tripping penalty coming up here comes the call that's certainly not going to help the team I mean they're losing by one they've got to find a way to get some momentum to get on the board now they find themselves killing the penalty The Wild have taken possession along the wall. certainly appreciate it, but man, you gotta find a way to generate offense, and the only way you can is when you're on the ice. Puck is dropped, and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Handles the pass from the right side. Sends it in front, and that chance is blocked. Quick pass to Haig. Slides the puck over. Oh, there's a great stop by Fleury. And the goaltender grabs that one for a whistle to 
try to slow things down here. Minnesota's attempt to put more pucks on net has paid off as they lead it in the third. And they win the draw here in their own end. Moves it quickly over to Boldy. And a great save! The key to being a great goaltender is not giving up second shot opportunities, and it's playing the rebounds to the corner. He does an excellent job here. Drives to the paint! Big time blocker stuck by Hill! Does a great job with some great pushes to get to the top of his crease and make the save from a high danger area. Love save made by Hill. And the goalie covers up for the whistle. A lot on the line here in this offensive zone faceoff. Vegas has it in their own end. And here's the pass to Amadio. Vegas has it against the half wall. Oh, and it stays out as he gets a piece of that one. Moves it to Petrangelo. the point it goes. Denies him with the save. And look at this. They really want to up the intensity here. And there's the whistle as the goaltender will give his team a much needed rest. Face off coming up here and Cheryl, let's see if they can keep that momentum going. No question about it, James. We know where the momentum lies right now after some sustained pressure. Heavy pressure, heavy floor check. Lots of shots going to the net. The goaltender is fatigued. You want to make sure that you can score and make it a one-goal game with that tally. And you can feel it coming, James. They've been playing way more aggressive. Their opponent's sticks are getting tight and they're panicking a little bit. I'm telling you, the time is now. This next shift, they got to build on that score. They are in one now. The Golden Knights desperately needed something, and they finally made it happen. Now well, they're in the final frame here, but they got one back, and you know what that's like as an opponent when you know that that team is coming and they're a wave. There's a lot of urgency, and they're a dangerous team right now. Here's a short pass to Stevenson. Great four check by Johansson. Stones him on the one-timer. From the back of the cage with the puck. Dies him! They just keep coming in waves here in the Across the line from center. Here's a chance at scores! He scores! What an opportunity and delivers! Well, it looks like they've reset the table. I mean, didn't get the start that they wanted, found themselves behind the eight ball, but it's amazing, James. It's an old cliche, but the game is never over until it's over. Vegas has tied the game, and guess what? We aren't going home yet. Yeah, no, we're not, are we, James? We're back in this game, and this is exactly where we want to be. When you have two teams going head-to-head -head like this, this is what it's all about. Let's go. The Golden Knights have it now. Takes the puck at the point. And that's broken up with a stick in front. The Golden Knights gain the zone. Shot! Too much traffic in the lane. Tries to get the puck to Spurgeon. Right up the gut into the offensive end. Vegas looks to move the puck from their own end. Quick feed to Kaprizov. Coming to the front of the net. And he was ready for that save. Answered the call there. Sends it in front. Dishes it off again here. Sends it deep inside the offensive zone. And he takes the feed. The Golden Knights take it across the line. Minnesota's got the puck. And he connects with the long bomb. Bumped off the puck. Vegas looks to get things going now with the puck. Picked up along the wall by Barbashev. Great reach with the poke check by Rossi. At center ice now, he grabs the puck. Went for the dirty dangle and it goes sideways. Sometimes when you lose the puck, it's a product of trying to do too much. Sometimes keeping it simple is more effective. 
Minnesota's got the puck inside the defensive zone. And they send it right back to him. Solid check to slow him down. And stops that big bomb. A big face off here inside the offensive end. The Golden Knights win the draw on their own end. Now a quick pass to Carrier. Vegas is across the blue line. Sends the pass down low. Takes the shot, and he makes a save there. And he keeps possession. Played, and now we're gonna head to overtime. Not all heroes wear capes. Some of them have skates. We'll find out who the hero is next. Are you hashtagging overtime challenge on social media? Because they're ready to get it underway. Will we get a winner? Time to find out. It's overtime. Vegas on the attack. Quick pass. Oh, he saved it. Oh, my goodness, what a star. Oh, that's unbelievable, James. I have no idea how he got to that puck. It's some gymnastics at its finest. And these fans are still passing apart. What we just saw, what a save that was, Cheryl. Yeah, he made an incredible save and really engaged this fan base. They're on their feet. You know they're right into the game. And listen, when they are showing you that kind of appreciation, you also want to play for them. The goaltender, they have to have talent. They have to have mobility. They have to be able to track the puck, but they have to have a willingness to find it and fight for any second shot. And that's exactly what happens here. Out battling, out willing, and you make the save. A big draw looming here in the offensive zone. Minnesota's won the faceoff deep in their own end. And he slides it quickly to Eric Sinek. Along the half wall with the puck. Oh, just a great heads up play by Petrangelo. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Eichel. Puts it on there. This is going to count, James. The official waves it off right away and got to wonder whether it was tipped, redirected off of the skate, or whether there was a kicking motion. So two distinct things here. If you kick or make that move, the forward motion of your foot towards the net, it will be a no goal. But if it's redirected, that's fine. The entire building erupts as the official comes back on the ice. It's a disallowed goal, and under further review, it is deemed just that. Face off here in the neutral zone, and we are back underway. Hard hit, frees up the puck. Kaprizov's taking it from his own end. He carries the puck up along the wing. Sends it into the offensive zone. Moves it quickly over to Theodore. The Golden Knights are on the attack. Shot! Stones him in front. And will get the whistle after the goaltender hangs on. A critical draw here. The Golden Knights take possession off the faceoff. Flurry's got the puck and he's gonna hang on. This is a faceoff. They'll definitely want to win here inside the offensive zone. Rossi's won the draw here in the defensive zone. Angles it over to Boldy. Takes the pass. Moves it to Boldy. Stops him cold. Ref blows the whistle as the puck's covered up. A lot on the line here in this offensive zone faceoff. Stevenson's won it in their own end. Vegas has the puck. Steps across the blue line. Center and feed. Picked off in front. Hartman's got it in the defensive end. Looks to get the puck over to Rossi. Along the right wing, they enter the attacking area. And now it's taken by Hartman. That's gloved by Hill. In front of the net, the goaltender covers up for a whistle on the play. A 
Big face off here inside the offensive end. The Golden Knights win the draw here in their own end. Moves the puck over to Barbashev. Quick shot, denies him with the save. Spurgeon's lugging the puck. Here's a short pass to Brodeen. Grabs the puck and looks to make something happen. Scrum along the wall. Picked up along the boards by Theodore. Fires it. Oh, what a stop. Can't hang on after that hit. And the puck's knocked loose. The Golden Knights have it against the wall. On the attack along the boards. Puck picked up by Felino. Through the neutral zone up along the wing. Throws it in. The Golden Knights move the puck in the defensive zone. Sends a pass over. For the win! And he denies him with a monstrous save here in overtime! Sent into the offensive zone. Slides it quickly to Stone. And now it's grabbed by White Cloud. The Wild have taken possession in their own end. Quick feed to Marcheseau. The Golden Knights looking against the half wall. And that's knocked away by Eichel. Looks for breakout options behind his own cage. And it's a quick pass to Eric Sinek. Tries to get it over to Marcheseau. Quick pass to Stone. Here's a chance! Big draw looming here in the offensive zone. Nice job tying up his opponent. Minnesota's got it in their own zone. From the left side, it moves to the middle of the ice. Moves it quickly over to Stone. Moves the puck. struggling to capitalize on their chances here. It's a tied game. They're so close to getting... For the win! And we're trying! We're not done yet after that save! Oh, and the pressure is on, and you can be the hero, and you're unable to cash in. That's a tough one to take when you're the shooter. Takes a shot! Simple glove save by Fleury. We got a whistle as the puck's frozen. Critical draw here. Minnesota's won the defensive zone draw. Scrum ensues along the boards. Pokes it away to stay on the attack. Carries it in. Feeds it down low. And someone's going off here as the ref's hand goes high in the air. Official calls a penalty in overtime and power play opportunity here to finish it off and win the game. Another sense of urgency for this man advantage unit as they go back to work. As a player, this is what you play for. Power play in overtime. The palms are sweaty, the heart rate is going. This is exactly what you love. They move the puck out of harm's way. Tries to get this man advantage going from their own end now. They go on the attack through center. Fires it on net. Turned aside with a glove by Fleury. Stevenson's ready for the draw on this man advantage. Off the face off, they take the puck. Here's an opportunity to get the puck out of their own end. Oh, that's a big time clearing attempt there. Yeah, that's a great defensive play. You gotta be strong on your stick. You gotta know where everyone is. And let's face it, coach knows exactly who's out there at this time of the game for that very reason. Oh, denies him with the paddle save. Both enders very aware of where that puck is in that low slot area. And defense is creased by getting out, being aggressive, and taking away any of the net. Rossi's gliding in for the face-off as this penalty kill will continue. The frozen miss gets dropped and we are back underway here. Vegas gains control of the puck. Flurry's 
going to give everyone a chance to breathe and hang on to the puck. Hope everyone's enjoying the game here tonight. Another big face-off here on this power play. And there's a little help from your friends right there from off the wing coming up with the puck. Minnesota's got the puck against the half wall. Can't maintain possession after that hit. And he slides it quickly to Marcheseau. Trying to engage a little physicality here. Minnesota's got a hold of the puck. And they get the puck out of the danger zone. Loses possession after he takes a little hit. And then looking to end it! And he keeps it alive! What a stop! And he totally whiffs on that one. Moves it to Marcheseau. And now he moves it quickly to Petrangelo. You can really score! There's your overtime winner! He's out! They scratched and they deserve that win tonight. Thanks so much for joining us for this postseason action and we will see you at the next playoff game. See you everybody.